I get to pick and choose who I draw and and people are just being themselves, you know? I mean, it's just fascinating, you know? This guy here, he's got his hand in his work. That's interesting to me, you know? Walt Taylor is the artist at Cafe Stella in Norfolk. He's got a long-standing trade in place, sketchbooks for free coffee. You know, it stuns me to see how, how many hundreds of people are drawing here. But everybody look, everybody's a little bit different, you know? It's a little bit unusual. That's what, that's what makes it fun. If they were, if everybody looked the same, that would get boring really fast. The retired cartoonist for the Virginian Pilot has been coming to the cafe across from his home for decades, and he considers this community part of his family. To keep his drawings genuine, though, he tends to keep to himself. They're usually not paying attention to me when I'm doing this, which is what really counts. If they start noticing that I'm drawing them, then that, that ruins the whole thing. So this is, this is when I'm being discreet and, and they don't know what I'm drawing and but I'm drawing them, you know. And, and it's just more interesting to me when they're just being themselves and sitting having coffee or doing something weird with their hands, you know. And sometimes um, when I'm bored I'll exaggerate people. He didn't really have a neck like that. He just drew it like that. And you can sense, if, if you go through a few years of this, you can sense a difference. Laptops show up a lot more often than they used to. You know, and their, their behavior is the same, you know, regardless of what they're using. Their behavior is the same, so that's kind of interesting. If you catch Walt at the cafe, ask him about his published work. Over the years, I've put together little books of my stuff. Um, like this, you know, and it's just different drawings. Some of these are mostly comical drawings. And then this is all pictures of downtown, places in downtown Norfolk. But I, sometimes I really love getting a fine detail, you know, and, and capturing what a shiny jacket would look like. And so that's a lot of fun to do. His goal is always to capture the element of a person that makes them unique. He wants people to be able to point to his drawing and say, hey, that's Jimmy. Once you get really into drawing people, being an artist and picking out what's what's unusual about them, then you realize everybody has something distinctive about them. And of course, it's also about the fun. When I'm in the mood, I get into a lot of detail and that's that's kind of fun to show what fabric looks like and hands and things like that. It's, it's just it's just fun. This is just something I love to do. If I didn't have this to do, I would be a very unhappy person. I love to make people smile. Savannah Hugdahl, 13 News Now.